The Sculptress by Minette Walters is a psychological thriller that explores the complexities of human nature through the lens of a murder mystery. The novel follows Olive Martin, a sculptor who has been convicted of killing and dismembering her mother and sister, as well as a young girl named Georgina, whose body was found buried in Olive's garden. The story is told from multiple perspectives, including those of the investigating police officers, a journalist, and Olive herself. One of the central themes of the novel is the nature of truth and the ways in which it can be manipulated or obscured. From the very beginning of the story, it is clear that Olive is a complex and enigmatic character who may not be entirely truthful about her role in the murders. As the story unfolds, it becomes clear that the people around Olive are similarly unreliable, and that their own agendas and biases are shaping their perceptions of the events. Another important theme is the relationship between appearance and reality. Olive's physical appearance is frequently described as grotesque and intimidating, with her massive size and scarred face making her seem like a monster to many of the people she encounters. However, as the story progresses, it becomes clear that Olive's appearance is not an accurate reflection of her inner self, and that she is in fact a deeply vulnerable and damaged person who has suffered a great deal of abuse and trauma. The novel also explores the concept of power and its various forms. Olive is initially seen as a powerless and marginalized figure, but as the story unfolds, it becomes clear that she has a great deal of power over the people around her, particularly the men who become fascinated by her. Similarly, the police officers who investigate the case are shown to be motivated by their own desire for power and recognition, rather than a genuine desire for justice. Throughout the novel, Walters employs a number of different narrative techniques to keep the reader engaged and guessing. The use of multiple narrators allows the reader to see the story from a variety of perspectives, each with their own biases and motivations. The nonlinear structure of the narrative, which jumps back and forth in time, creates a sense of disorientation and uncertainty that mirrors Olive's own fractured mental state. In terms of character development, Olive is clearly the most fully realized and complex character in the novel. Walters does an excellent job of exploring the various facets of Olive's personality, from her vulnerability and need for love and acceptance, to her capacity for violence and manipulation. Despite the fact that Olive is a convicted murderer, the reader is never quite sure whether to believe her claims of innocence, or whether she is simply a master manipulator. The other characters in the novel are somewhat less well-developed, but still interesting in their own right. Sergeant Cooper, one of the investigating police officers, is a sympathetic and likable character who provides a counterpoint to the more cynical and ambitious detectives he works with. The journalist Rosalind Lee, who becomes fascinated by Olive and begins to write a book about her, is a more ambiguous figure, whose motivations are never entirely clear. Overall, The Sculptress is a compelling and thought-provoking novel that delves deep into the dark recesses of the human psyche. Through its exploration of themes like truth, appearance, power, and manipulation, the novel offers a nuanced and complex portrait of a deeply troubled woman and the people whose lives she touches. With its vivid characters, clever plot twists, and haunting atmosphere, The Sculptress is a true masterpiece of the psychological thriller genre.